Shameless, Season 2, Episode 10, True Love Dad used to say, never a lender or borrower be. Bit rich coming from a bankrupt crackhead. He's wrong, cause since the Gallagher's moved next door, we lent, they borrowed, paid back. Cash for Chatworth. The truth is, I like it. They make a lot of people around here feel needed. Well, what better off anyway? I haven't been anything, I haven't done anything wrong. He's a social worker, not a policeman. He called uh, your house a few times with no luck. Steve, now Deborah, Mr. Bannister to you. Call me Steve when you start answering your front door. Deal, sit down. Right. Deborah Gallagher, you look well enough. How's the rest of the family? Really good. Right, Fiona, I need you to hear this. Thanks for your support. Cash for Chatsworth, last chance to buy the winning ticket for tonight's prize. Tonight's prize is two tickets to this weekend's Lady Mayoress's Ball. Don't be shy, it's black tie. The Lady Mayor wants you there. Bit more ice in this, it's getting warm. Has your Brendan forgot about you? Of course, he's head if it, if it weren't screwed on. I once bumped under, on, into the fella that wrote this. Ah, Scouse fella. Rubbish, it's from Carousel. Jerry thing, thingy. Jane of Pacemakers. Get your facts right. Bo Selector, just ignore him. Lily, la, la, Lillian Love. There you go, the Scouse National Anthem. Lillian, can I have a word? Your Brendan's been knocked down. Corner of Sprayson Street. To be honest, he looks pretty rough. Police are coming, are coming, looking for you. Oh dear God, look, come on, Lillian. I'll go with you. What the fuck have the police got to do with it? There's a police van and knocked Brendan over. He's dead. Don't say that. Don't want to tell her. Here we go. Another one. Telling you for a fact. Dot com. How the fuck would you know? Whether someone's got a pulse so of this shagging a bird, double your age. Because Brendan's body landed on the inside of the street. But his head landed on lips. Way too much fucking information. Are you ready? Shouting. Can't you hear? Can't hear you. Yeah, we're not on the jockey, cocky jockey roll over raffle for this, for the lucky monkey all night party. A Laroness, but Lady Marinus Bowl is 27. I'm a 27 year old. Oh, no. oh, yeah, yeah. Have we got a winner? Where's me 27? I had 27. Who's got me 27? Who's got me 7? Number 27 here, winner. Yeah, we won. Who would have thought that? Frank Gallagher. More jam than Hartley's. Fix, fix. That's all I've got like to say. It's my birthday next week. No, I've never been 47 before. We can't believe it. This could have not have come at a better time. Oh, it's not a world. I've been feeling a bit post-natural. Natal, because I've got eight kids. Oh, you're right, Deb. Fiona, what happened? Nothing. I, I just need somewhere out there. There's God. God shining a light. What? Steve's back. Who's telling you that? Steve, I saw him. He's desperate to meet you. Came to school. Now he's, is she having a drink for my birthday or what? No, Craig. She's leaving home. <clears throat> at, least you, at least let her have a lager and thingy. Craig, do us a favour and F keep an eye on the drinks before Dad goes. Does that, uh, yeah? He tried to contact you at work, but he doesn't know you're moved. I know, the nursery passed his number a couple of days back. You need to ring him. No, you ring him. Tell him to stay the fuck away from me. You or any of us. Uh, Kev, pint of lager with a big, very big E. Keep your voice down, Frank. Members of the council win. Pint of lager and a very small valve, if you will. Vicky, how is it hanging, Bernie? These mouths, if we were the friends, shouldn't you have, been, have told me you're going to stand against me for this ward? Ah, uh, but we're not, so no need. You know, test your own popularity, and it can't stomach smell of rotting failure. Yeah, bet. Best to beat a winner when a winner's truly beat, which you are. So go screw yourself, you greedy fat bastard. Cash is going to trounce you. Be scared, be very scared. Now fuck off. Can't believe what you just did. That was Lillian's ticket. Fuck off. All night party for two. What's he going to do? Take his head? Don't know what to say, Mrs. Tyler. The officer driving a van will live with this for the rest of his life. His cat managed to stay on. 
I know, Green Tilby. Yeah, surely that's how he'd like to have died. A little bit of his old-fashioned dignity. Yeah, but not before he turned 65. That looks like you. Looks like you. Any more orders for breakfast? Say now or do it yourself, not for us. Lena's giving us a lift to school. Lena's giving me his lift to school. It's the same school. If you want to watch if you want to watch us fucking car horn beeps as at every two minutes sit down. Oh you're right in the head shagging a sixteen year old. What's that about? It's legal. Where do you get off telling me him what to wear? Getting his hair cut. You're not his mother, neither you, Fiona. What's going on? Nothing. Fiona likes the way I do my makeup. i just given me her a few tips. See ya. See you later, Fiona. See you later, Debs. He wanted me to give you something. Forget it. Don't want to know. But hey, 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 what about Levin? I try and lick my solids. Same again for lunch, but a bit more lumpy. You could sleep till about 6.30. Sleep. Sing them some Cliff Richard and then go off. For ten minute, more minutes. We've got a spare room all sorted. You're coming to Auntie V's and Uncle v- Kev's for the weekend. You love it. Going to love it. I wouldn't ask if I d- can't let the Lady Mayonnaise down. Sight of him, big head, little legs. Which Kev Richard, Shudder? Well, any part of the Millennium Prayer. If we all else fail, sing them Jerusalem. It would go out like a pair of candles. Here's... How's there God if his head ends up that far away from his boots? Come again. Don't actually register Brendan's death, the town hall. How can I not? He's in all the papers. Yeah, but the only next of kin has authority to actually register the death. I don't, I am saying don't. I'll turn up and sign for his benefits, 80 quid a week. But split 60 40, you my favour. Well, then you've got to lose. Yeah, but I mean, Brendan, God bless him. He never used Use my f- no fucking ornament to do you to you now, is he? I struggle without his money. Well, yeah, but Buddhism is all about if you're not facing the dead, behave like they're still here. Huh? You have to take Sadie off me hand. Sadie, Sadie, I hate the thing. Every time we had sex, he held it to be let out. Never wrecked on me, nearly necked to a marriage. Anyway, nobody's more of a dog person than me, Lillian. Oh, right, good. Tire. Yeah. Frank, come on, Sadie. Who's the beauty? Who's the beauty? Meat. Sack, meat, sack. Come on. Come on, Scooby fucking do. Row, 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 row your boat. Jenny down stream. What are you up to? What have you done to that bag? Caught it in the fence. Likely story. Has been burnt. Electric fence. You need to know what danger lies ahead of you. Yeah, are you threatening me, Bernie? If you split the vote, we have a lunatic's burning tracks worth. You kip, I kip, we kip. You should have thought about that before you refused us planning extension back. Is that what this is all about? Well, why didn't you say? A few telephone calls, fix that, no problem. What have you of your vons saying, saying Bernie's too late? You crossed the line. We're sick of having to slip you backhanders for anything we're doing. People are sick of you charging for democracy. Aren't you the noble one? Noble, you'd be buggered. Kes gets on planning committee. He's never going to have to work another day in his life. Then we might be able to afford an apartment in Spain to buy Bernie's. He's forced to sell up. Be careful what you wish for. What key are you in? What's up, Debs? You can't blame Fiona. Steve's left her eye dry. Fine, if that's all he did. But he'll come back to put things right. Bad timing, sweetheart. She's having Craig's baby by accident. Yeah, she made some big decisions that she can't unpick. She likes Craig, but loves Steve more than she ever loved anybody. I'm the one of the lucky ones, but we can't all have the perfect ending. Here we go. They were out of hot chocolate, but I've got mushroom sh- soup, a bit of grass to calm me down. Kev, well, not for Debs, obviously. I need to make a phone call. Get Debs to show you how to download and remove it files. This inheritance tax is a nutshell. This twisted shit came up with a little gem, inheritance tax. I made sure that my kids wouldn't be saddled with that kind of torment once I've gone. Cashing the policies. Let them watch you blow the lot while you have a breath left in your body. Listen to the lady. Where there's a wheel, there's a way. What are you going to leave behind? A couple of skid marks? Could answer a prayer. 
you fat cunt. Oh, he just paid your drink up. Me? What for? Because he brought us a double. double. You must think it's simple. He's buying booze that's not allowed. Rum and black, please. Bless you, Bernie. Oh, for hello, gorgeous. Is that a little minx you've taken off Lillian's hands? One stroke of luck in 15 years at my lot, is it? Recovering Chatworth East. Miss Teller's car. Go, let's go, go, go. What, not you? Why not? Well, who's going to help me in the shop? Verera. Verena. You left your bloody bag, Lillian. Are you okay? What's this lot doing doing here again? Postmortem found that your Brendan had a bullet in his head. He killed him instantly. You see, that's why we, he never dodged out the way of the van. Ballistic is certain the bullet came from the same gun using drugs killing last month. No drugs, Brendan. He found out teen class A drugs. His system, your death would have been part of a turf war game. Job. We need you to come down the station and clear a few things up. Is that all right, Miss Tyler? Yeah, all right, lads. Put her in the van, Lillian. But he was no druggie. Look at him, for God's sake. Postmodern shows he was using marijuana, vitamins, plus solvents and common adhesives. Face is totally self-inflicted. Fitting him out to get out of paying your co- any conversation, you devious buggers. Stand CTV shots for bookies at the end of Eastern Street. Five seconds before my van rams into Brandon. Brandon gets a bullet in the head. Both against like his skinny with a white bag, legs it from the scene. Chatsworth school back uniform C. Probably a drug runner. Right, come on, Stan. Let's round up the local skinheads. Starting from, with the school. Then, then you go. You're the one with the gob. Why didn't you try getting elected? A. I'm one that runs this business properly. Maybe. People generally hate my guts. Give over. People respect you personally. I couldn't give a shit. But, but you're going to love Crash. Having him making a name for himself. And then you think he's married to a hard-nosed bitch. Cheryl Blair helps Tony to get elected. Said, when did Cash need elected to feel better wanted? Since I told him to. Have you got a problem with that? Yeah. Cash wins. I'm stuck here. Doing extra hours for you. Just so you can be somewhere else. And you think... I studied all this to keep your two apart. Well, haven't you? What are you doing in here? Looking for drugs, if you must know. Try asking. Proper drugs. Where's Fiona? She wasn't. She wouldn't have any. She's skint. Now, well, what about you, Cole? Have a look at this. Pass, pass it. Help. Where, where's he gone? Do you want a cup of coffee, Greg? No, Tar. I think I'll shoot up for a shower. Fiona's up there. Don't know where she is. She nipped around to Veronica's to fix the washing machine. No, she hasn't. Does she know how? She's fine. It's fine. It's working. Pray, Steve, I'll try and talk to you. Don't be go taking it out on Debbie. I agree with her. Well, calm. Couldn't ten minutes do. You know fucking well what harm it would do. If I agree and I show up, what have I got to tell him that he wants to hear? He probably wants to know whether you still love him or not. If I do, of course I do. What job good's that going to do when he knows I'm pregnant? You're not going to want to hear that, is he? I don't know, sweetheart. You better ask him yourself. And I I was really don't know what I'm supposed to say. Debbie matters shit. When it's late, I'm not late, am I? Fuck off. Carl said your washer needs wanted seen to. That doesn't well, that won't work, Jesus. Let's have a look. Got soap pad in my eyes. Come and splash. Have you got any towels? Veronica. Towels upstairs. Stay there, Craig. Hang on. Stay there, I'm not moving. Get upstairs, Ronco. No. All right, I'll just blame me, and I'm not saying that I asked him around here, not her. Can you come up here a sec, Carl? Well, for I'll talk about Tuesday night. You little prick, what have you done? What have you gone and done? Lay it, get off me. Lay off him. Debs, he's in big trouble. Get off me, I've shot him. Brendan, it's me, all right? What did he say? Didn't mean to kill anybody, I swear. I need a straight answer, Fiona. Is that my baby? Don't answer that. Ask him if he, that, ma- that matters. Well, look, came here for you. Whatever that meant, had a hell of a lot of of that I don't bank on. I'm still here. So what does that mean? Shut your fucking mouth if I do a lot of people favour and take you out. Back of the long queue, actually, man. If all he wants to know is if it's his baby, then what's the question? What's his question? Fuck off. Craig, oh my God, Craig, can you hear me? Look, let me see. 
You need to fuck off. If the police find you here, we'll be all dead. Watch yourself. Oh, my God. What have you done? Oh, my God. Hey, sweetheart, it's okay. Your ambulance is here. Here, six Swansea Gardens, Chatworth Estate. Please, Fenner, I can't live without you. Why me? And he, he needs someone with him. I can't see what happened. He banged his fucking head. What more do you need to know? Yeah, go, go. Come on, that's it. Yes, yes, come on. Come here. Now I'm having flashback to Jack Brennan. Here, nightmare. Baby, what now? Now hang on, shut up. Don't want to know what cannabis is. It's on big script for Brendan's glaucoma. He uses glue, a bit of fun with the matches. Do you admit that they sniff glue on match dates? No, the matches. Okay, does not explain the amphetamine sulfate? Also found in mine. I was on the lo- them long before they, they were popular. I sit one in the di- his dinner. We told jokes I never f- I heard before. So you're getting speed on the NHS to come off it. Now collapse. Are you going to have a habit of, of it, of his baby? No, it isn't. It's yours. Look, if we get married as soon as we get here, there, we turn to the blue bedroom flat. We turn over the odd car, if you be, be careful. You know, pay for bills and food and stuff. You have to put you, get a part-time lo- job, though. Pay for our drinking habits. I'm not drinking. But then we sort it out. Even if I could do this to Craig, I couldn't leave my family. Family have been here before. They don't need as much as you think they do. They don't. Just ask them. I promise you, Fiona, I won't let you down again. I'll make you happy. Don't bake. I can't bake. You just make it look like you know, know how to. You snap out of it or disappear. I don't want her to go. To get neither would I if you were so much bothered as you. Tough shit, Carl. Fiona's going. Say one thing word about Fuzzy does. I'll cut your tongue out. Got it? And that goes for all of you. If you only find out about Carl, you're dead. Fed's phoned. Craig signed himself out. Seven stitches and signs himself out. You're getting a t- taxi. I should speak to him, don't. You'll fall apart and change your mind. It's the least he deserves. It's, no, it's not second best. He used to get getting out over stuff like this. Hope this is the last of them. Got Steve on the back seat under a blanket. Like you think it's for someone else. Elsa, come on, will you hurry, hurry, up, hurry, hurry, move it, we're going to be fine, look at me, stay at me, I found my baking hands, of hoping to send you, while I'm with you, take care of yourself, we need a number, in case anything goes wrong, come here, hey, see you, beautiful, where are you off to, just going on a holiday, give me a kiss, I cuddle Fiona, we're going to hurry, when are those cakes going to be ready, it's no good, I can't leave him, no you can, don't destroy her, are going to collect him. He's moving in with them. Is that true? Don't be soft. Can't they let him near me, Dad? Sorry. Yeah, we better be. Come here, you two. I love you. I'll be in touch. I love you better. Do. So where am I taking you? Car parked in Grimpton. See ya. See ya. I got chucked off the bus for swearing. Fuck you, twat. Fat bastard. Started walking home. Then that was when I found it. Didn't know what it was at first. Lying in the grass. It was dead heavy and cold. I knew it wasn't a toy. The fact that you had a gun isn't the point, Carl. Why didn't you tell one of us or hand it in somewhere? I wanted to know what it felt like. I took it to school, but no one knew. Didn't know if it was still loaded until I saw you two playing fo- footy in Eastern Street. Hey, Brendan, get your tits out. Gunshot, whoa, watch it. Shit, I didn't know it was loaded. Fucky in fucking hell. Shit, oh Christ. I'm sorry. Where's the gun now, Carl? Of course, come on. Somebody take it off me quick. What's going on? Where are they? Where's Steve? We're gone, Craig. Fiona's gone. Fiona, Craig? She's got the gun, Craig. Gunshot, do you think that? So you, do you not think it looks like? No. Looks more like Gull Gallagher to me. That's what I think. Let's get over there and try to eliminate him. I wish somebody would. Is a cull anywhere? I'll handle this. How's things, Carl? Fine. Why? Look, it looks a bit tired. Been busy, have you, me, son? Uh, where were you about half six on Tuesday night? I said easy, he was in the hospital, at hospital. Where's your call? Oh, what for? Something really wouldn't want to discuss circumcision, right? Well, come on onwards and outwards. I see, Stan. You know you're not on your own, Carl. There's no shame in it. Whatever you got, was ever got, none. Ever. You won't look back. We're all, well, not much. You're right in the head. Are you right in the head? Are you buying all this shit? 
How long before you suss that one? Enough time to rent up some skinheads. He was only one. He was only in overnight. Tuesday night. What for? I can't disclose that. Boy, he's a very sensitive gen, that gen, gentle, gen, gentle surgery. Fine, thank you, sister. You're welcome. Don't care if D fifty says that that's Carl Gallagher. Now, when on the right mind, make going to make something up like that, right? D fifty. But there, put it there, Fairy, Perry, Fizz, Pete, Minty. So everybody's explained it's for charity. Will you shut up? He looks like a pleper. Give us a minute. What's this? It's supposed to be swoosh. Swoosh? Does Carl have a swoosh? No. Come on, Carl. Carol, hurry up. Should get more than a tenner for this. Get the two. Number two. Turn on the side, please. We're fucked. Square one. Sorry, Craig. Cheers, mate. We're just depressed. Fiona's dumped. No, she's all, he's all right, is Craig. Full time job house. That's paid for and no bad, not bad in bed. Take him in the box and suck him off. Could be a decent future in it for you. Hiya, gorgeous. Fuck, cheer up. Might never happen. If it helps, Fiona told me she didn't know for definite. The baby was yours. Sorry I'm late. Who are you? This is Mick. He's helping me out a couple of nights a week. It's up to you which two nights you drop. I knew it. You two, you hard face, two face, sour face, bit face. And you which two nights you want to work at the jockey? I got the your job, your job, glass collecting. Since cats will spend more time in their socialising, he's going to stand a chance. Whoops. Mick's old enough to serve booze so he can cope with his own for an hour. I'll be back at ten, Mick. No sweat. Never mind questions in the house. We need quick answers in the house. Ian? In your own time, love, people forget it took centuries, but the working men's vote, the most powerful weapon you ever possesses. These people forget, get your own, get your toothbrush. Six inches, oh, hello. What are you talking, taking? Where are you taking the Princess of Darkness, Wales? Beds are good. Wales, fuck you for. Baby Dick, my sister's just had a baby. It's still a big deal in Wales, is it? You look fantastic, Martin. Up the arse when you're ready. Large white. Ryan, please, Karen. Karen, wow, well, have you got the tickets? Show me a limo. I haven't got a, couldn't get a limo, so to get us for the minibus. All right, fair enough. Well, did you say something, Cash? <coughs> I didn't. I can't see you. Bit dark. That's a racist mark. Been wondering a shopkeeper's campaign <coughs> is value for money, and all he and his family ever done was bring down the price prices. Is that the way you bubble out? But it's the truth. Gloves off. You better listen to the echoes, half a wanna. Ladies and gentlemen, I offer up new selection, sanitation, selection, and your dedication, your election. Nothing but a third grade generation immigrant trying to revent the glory of the Union Jack. You two faced racist, fascist cunt. Anyone really knows where my heart lies. My heart's in Chatworth. I prove it every single day by keeping the shop open for 12 fucking hours. Uh, as what profit margins, ladies and gentlemen? I'll flush him out, Cash. Name a single other shop that takes milk tokens of booze. Fine. A hey, constituents, my brown, brown friend, he supports the blacks, the chinks, to complete fucking leg, leg irons, a scrub of scum. Bleed his fucking nation dry. Yeah, Bunny. One of your get the car. Now, quick, Cash for Jack was. Weird, where? That her here. Not, I got one thing to, I, I need to say. Night before he died, I gobbed on Brendan from the upstairs of a bus and called him a rank Ed, Ed Gook. Just that. Anything is making sure everybody knows how much a week we need to stay in the black. We always manage before Debs. If you're on his wages, meaning everybody needs to bring an extra 15 a week. Not me, I'm not family, leaves us on Martin. Makes no difference. Can't match the rent rise. You will have to advise for new tenants. Right, she's right, Carol. You and all. You can't go blowing your spends of crows. They do, that is that lip. You earn about three times more than you're telling us. What's that? This is old, this is on old Cliff Richards. What are you doing? Trying to get Pinky and Perky to sleep. Fucking is insomniac, so what? Cliff didn't work after dark. Try it. Jerusalem. Did, did those feet in ancient times walk upon her England's mountain green? Was the Holy Lamb of God of England's pleasant pastures? What's going on here? 
I thought it was all nighter. Frank got a bit sick doing pudding, so the Lady Mariness had to get us a car home. Like a girl's voice? No, it was a police car. Hello, baby, cried. Wakey, wakey. Do you wake? Do I? Why do you wake? Do those feet in ancient times walk upon England's golden man's green? That was the holy lamb of God of England's pleasant, precious scene. Ple- past his scene. If I could shoot sperm, doesn't swim backwards. I have my own family by now. Meantime, I'm sitting on, settling on for this, for this one. Oh, sweet Jesus. Hey, I'll call you Bren. Could I, I call you Brendan or Bernadette?